Good morning, Bear Buddies. This is the week of um, January 11th through January 18th, 2021. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge of allegiance to the flag, to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Let's check in with our special reporters to learn about this week in history and some tips for being a Barrow Buddy. Massive earthquake strikes Haiti. On January 12, 2010, Haiti was devastated by a massive earthquake. It drew an outpour. It drew out an outpouring of support from around the globe, but the small nation has yet to fully recover. Martin Luther King Jr. is born. On January 15, 1929, Martin Luther King Jr. was born in Atlanta, the son of a Baptist minister. King received a doctorate degree in theology and in 1955 helped organize the first major protest of the African American Civil Rights Movement, the successful Montgomery boycott. Information from the Stay in History. Celebrations this week. January 11th, Step in a Puddle and Splash Your Friends Day. January 12th, Poetry at Work Day. January 13th, Sticker Day. January 14th, Dress Up Your Pet Day. COVID Tip of the Week. Masks can save lives. Choose masks masks that completely cover your nose and mouth. Bear Buddies are brave. This week, we're focusing on the letter R. R stands for responsible. One way to be responsible is having all your materials with you and ready for the day. Here's our principal. Good morning, Barrow Buddies. It's been a while since you've probably seen me, even though we've been in school virtually for a week, um, as this is our first BTV of 2021. I hope that you enjoyed your winter break and the holidays that you celebrate, and I want to wish everybody a happy new year 2021. I hope that you had a good week of school this past week and are looking ahead to the week coming up and going to be ready for lots of great learning. I just want to remind you that Attendance is super important and you need to be at school, which means on Zoom, log on every day, participating in your teacher's classes and um, participating with your class. While we were away on break and learning, um, I think some news that we are excited about is that the United States received vaccines for COVID-19. Vaccines are shots that give people a little bit of the virus, which ends up protecting them against getting the virus and people in Athens have already started receiving the COVID vaccine, like our doctors and nurses and healthcare workers. Some people who are older are gonna be receiving it and other first responders like firemen and police officers. And soon we're hoping that teachers will be able to receive the COVID vaccine, which means that we will be more protected and more likely to be able to have school in person. So that is really exciting news that this happens quickly and that hopefully we will have better protection against this virus that has really impacted all of our lives at home and at school. We also had some sad things that happened in our country last week, uh, mainly in our nation's capital in Washington, D.C. And in this coming week, um, some of your classes may be talking about some of the things that happened and everybody can be thinking about ways to be kind and loving to one another. Um, those are important skills that we want all students at Barrow to have. And also being brave as a Barrow buddy. And I think especially one word we're really gonna talk about is being bold and speaking up, even when you see something that is wrong, um, even if it's not popular and how you um, stand up for what you think is right. So those are some important concepts that we're gonna be talking about. Again, attendance is important, so please make sure that you are attending um, Zoom school every day this week, and we'll be talking about classes that had great attendance this week. 
We had some Vera Buddy birthdays last week that we want to wish happy birthday to um, Caleb Wilhite, Jonah Toon, Melanie Hambrick, Stella Savage Motes, Bruce Lee Bouvet, Elizabeth Hodge, Lauren Faust, Elijah Tooks, Ashani Lewis, Jeremiah Jackson, Ebony Rankin, Roy Faust, Yu Chen Yoon, and Bryson Tappan, and Justin Lee. And then this coming week, happy birthday to Justice Powell, Ashton Flanagan, Jack Allen, Sakai Lynch, Charles Pride, Tanner Van Note, Mai Young Chen, Iquarian Smith, Violet McElhannon, Zayla McKeever, Esther Jordan, Stella Krim, Max Selleck, and Misha Wilson. Happy birthday, buddies. We also have some teacher birthdays. Uh, Mr. O has a birthday. Ms. Virtus celebrated last week and coming up, Ms. Young has a birthday. <clears throat> Ooh, shout outs. We have a lot of shout outs, which I'm excited about. This one is a shout out for Miss Vaughn from Miss Vaughn. She says, I want to thank me for believing in me. I want to thank me for doing all hard work. I want to <clears throat> thank me for having no days off, never quitting, for always being a giver and trying to give more than I receive. And I want to thank me for trying to do more right than wrong. I want to thank you for just being me at all times. So Miss Vaughn, shout out to you. Miss Brink and Miss Samantha want to shout out. Our second graders, here's to a strong start to 2021. We can't wait to see all the growth and learning that will take place these next few months. And Ms. Leggett would like to give a shout out to her third graders. They have been so flexible this school year and continue to work hard each week. Keep up the great work. Ms. Mullins is sending a big shout out to our fourth grade writers who were bold achievers and share their strong voices through their opinion writing with our entire class. Benjamin, Corinthian, Hodges, Jonah, Joshua, Nolan, Ojas, and Winston. Their topics included the best food ever, killing sharks, unique foxes, the Black Lives Matter movement, Pokemon, and Minecraft update 1.17. Ms. Kaplan would like to give a shout out to room 18 for working very hard during virtual learning, whether logging on and being engaged in learning to uploading work to Class Dojo portfolio. Ms. Chambers and I are very proud of you. I, Dr. Sabatini, would like to give a shout out to Mrs. Byrne, who's been doing a great job keeping track of attendance and recognizing students for good attendance. Also, congratulations to Carlene Sampaio, who has received four improved attendance awards this past quarter. So great job, Carlene. Ms. Automa sends a shout out to Crew 122. We had many bold learners our first days back from break, participating well and with cameras on. We also had so many achievers who completed independent work on our two asynchronous days. Way to go, brave buddies. We're proud of you, crew. The second grade team is sending a big shout out to the specials team, Ms. D, Ms. Portage, and Ms. Strickland, and Ms. Mills for jumping in when needed to support our classrooms during virtual learning. Here's to starting out 2021 strong. Thank you, it means so much. Ms. Boyle wants to send a shout out to her room 223, engage Vera buddies for logging on and sharing their work on Flipgrid and Class Dojo portfolio. Keep up the great work, Ms. Boyle's class. Ms. Grant would like to give a shout out to Ms. Kelly, Ms. Sullivan in the students room too for being so flexible in our day-to-day -day learning. Hope you all have a great week. Before we leave, let's all say our Barrow Honor Club together. As a Barrow buddy, I promise to be fair, honest, and trustworthy, even when no one is looking, because that is the right thing to do. My good choices will help make Barrow excellent. We will now we will now observe a moment of silence before before we begin to focus all of our attention on thinking, learning, and working at Barrow School. Have a great day.